Hello everyone, what's going on? It's Attic. And Ian. Hello everyone. And Ian mentioned in the last episode that there was a cave we could go to. In which I made an, a mock, a scared ex explanation of what Square Enix probably was thinking. Which, you know what the funny thing is, Gutsa? What? We're actually going to that cave. <laughs> oh yeah, the cave in which we get the most useless, have to use the most useless item again. Or vehicle again, hooray. Yeah. Now there's just one little thing stopping me. Where, Where is, is was that? <laughs> oh, there it is. Where? Yeah, if you remember this from the Take to the Skies optional episode, this is the town of Mithril. Oh yeah, hi Mithril. Also another thing, this is the Honey Badger. That's Honey Badger? Honey Badger don't give shit, man. Are you learning of course that? not. Alright. No, don't fish. throw my stick away, no! Don't throw the stick away, where'd my stick go? Not oh, there it is. Anyway, in the last episode, we had an incredibly good laugh. That we did. And we lost two good men. Two very good men. May they both rest in peace. Yeah. Or I guess in, in Sid's case, may he rest in bacon. <laughs> bacon. Of course. Ha, ah, the adamant grotto. Beat it, I'll talk to you only when you bring me back a tail. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> the hunt for a tail. Then I found an unusual orange here, but he... Rather find those. Where do I find the tail? Um, honestly, I don't fucking. Re I do not remember. Well, not in the focus. You know what? I'm going to investigate this. Give me a moment. Okay. Um, I just learned that we cannot go into the adamant grotto we quite can't. yet. Not yet, because they're pretty much gonna just kick him out, saying, "Now you cannot go in here." Until we get a certain item that we'll be getting later. Anyway. Back of over course. to Eblon, because Eblon, we need to go. I believe Eblon needs just to keep this in. And here we are. Right, here's where we started. So drop off your little toy ship thing and go across all the many reefs. Just get over to this teeny little cave. And look at it, it's a tiny cave. Tiny cave of tangness. Um, this I will apologize. Is the cave. To everyone who is wondering if I sound kind of distracted, I am like currently doing a challenge Dude, of Minecraft I have not done may, before. This place may just rip me apart. It's a possibility that it might. One of those like skull deer things I just fought literally like ripped a huge hole in Rydia. Wow, going. that. That that says everything. Shut up. No no no, I wasn't saying that as a bad thing, I'm saying that might actually be kind of a like we might you might actually be in trouble kind yeah, of situation. Yeah, you're doing like around three to four hundred damage to us and that's not exactly a good thing. Never think so either. They, they definitely don't want to be your friend. Yeah, so uh, I know I said that I'm gonna be doing my best to get a lot of treasure. But in a place like this, especially with tough enemies, treasure may be the one thing I'm not going to bother with until later. Oh, yeah, it's like one of those cases, it's like, it's... Where? Where are the private people of Eblon? I'm in Eblon already? 700 to stay a night? Jeez. Talk about cheapskates. Well, it... Kind of goes that saying with what happened to them. Anyway. You know. Oh, item shop. Well, yeah, they were pretty much like driven out. But oh well. Yeah, now we're going to explore Ablad. Ooh, armor and weapons. Here's a armor shop, which has ice stuff and ice armor and a black robe, which is helpful for Rydia, but unfortunately, we do not have a lot of stuff to get. We don't have enough money to get some of this stuff, so. Yeah, you, you kind of don't. I mean, we could get some. Actually, this would actually be a good time to sell off some of the things we don't need. Like, we we could keep this membership pass. Actually, we will. We, I will tell you this now, uh, the claws are in no more of a uh, need. Yeah, sadly, they're... 
We have lost a good man. The Mithril Staff, we do not need any longer. Uh, the Ice Lance, we don't need because Kane doesn't really need to use that. The Great Bow, no. Fire Shield, no. Feather I'm Cap. slowly starving to death, great. Uh, mithril Armor, we may want to keep that. Uh, Green Beret, definitely want to keep. Kent Bogey. Unfortunately, we can't keep that. The Black Belt, keep that just as an end case thing. We'll sell this Vampire Fang, I don't know why, but we will. Okay. There's nothing else that can really benefit anybody in here except for Rosa because she needs the, uh, well, she could get the poison arrows if she wanted to, but there's really no point to get them. And if you're saying, oh my game. god. So, I mean, oh, so grab an ice armor if you don't have enough for a, uh, oh, that, that's. Ice armor. Terrible. Sell your flame mails that's because I don't really think you'll need your flame mails any longer. I just discovered something kind of terrible. What's that? Um, hardcore more. You can actually die. You can actually starve yourself to death. Yeah, you've always been able to starve yourself to death. And no, 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 no. Never before. You're only left with like half a heart, but that literally just killed you. I will actually say this now. You do want to grab a black robe for Rydia because it does a lot better for her defense and it ups her magic so which saving your man which getting her magic up is very nice okay. I mean, oh, I know, that's good I sir have I, you have I told it. you the most broken have I told you about the exploitation of a certain broken spell in this game aka bio oh god yes that, yeah. is pro that spell is so broken it's amazing uh, there are some pretty useful ish Night or not? Oh, good saving way. Damn it, naming way! How do you even get around these parts? I don't know magic. A wizard casts a spell on him. That's how. Yes, I want to change my name. I'm gonna change it to Kill Naming Way. <laughs> and literally name everyone like Kill Naming Way. That'd probably be like the cleverest like name thing ever. Little girl needs to get out of my way. She's tr who strangely looks like how Porum, I believe, the, the girl of the two. Yeah. I think there is one item here around, like, in the inn you can get. I just don't remember if it's actually there or not because aliens cast a spell in there. Yeah, because aliens and a wizard. Because all the reasons of incompetence. But yes, uh, let's. You head this way. Uh, Prince went to scout ahead. Passway. Passway leads to the Tower of the Velvet Rubicante. Is. Mr. Rubicante. Yeah, oh, hi, buddy. That's you. The four elemental lords. Really? And kind of is, actually. It's really cool about that. Why is this. Why is <laughs> well, you did a wonderful there? job as the generic guard. Why is this prince of theirs going alone? Please no, it's maybe as death. Are we supposed to be stopping the, the prince? prince or or stop Rubicante? Probably both. I'm gonna assume. I, I mean, Ru Rubicante. That seems to be like goes without saying. Oh. Dude, there's like a ton of treasure. Oh, yeah, that's right. There is like a lot of treasure yeah, in this place. Can. Also, uh, I'll tell you this now, shurikens. You may just want to have all. The shurikens are your friend, Cottage, but keep them souvenirs. because. They will run away from you and leave you. More score dealers. School deers. Eh. Kane. Sculptures. Just like randomly saying Kane out of my name. like Kane, Kane, Kane. <laughs> Skelter, Skeletor, another side. Kane. Spider I like more soldiers. Ooh, another spider silk. Silver eyeglass. Phoenix down. Phoenix down. Dude, I'm getting like helpful stuff here. I believe there's a secret Indeed. passage around here somewhere that you can get. Yeah, there's like a. I think it's like past the stairs. It's like a way you can sneak in. I forget which how you get in, but those freaking bats are annoying. I think it's on the other side. No, 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 I think it literally is, like, might be on the... Well, I mean, there should be, like, two ways of getting in there, I think. I don't yeah, know. but I'm just... Well, maybe it is on the other... Probably is on the other side, I don't know. Well, that's what I was... I thinking. don't remember! Burp, burp, burp. That might be it right there. It's, like, right... Yep, here it is. Yeah, like, next... Above that rock. Yep, elixir and... Ooh! Dude, if I would have 
If I wouldn't have gotten those, I would have missed out on two elixirs. Which I She's... think I have a nice amount of elixirs at this moment. Five? Okay, she... that's a decent amount. Which is good because you can't really buy elixirs ever. You can't, like, freaking hoard them like you can in Final Fantasy V. By means of just trading or... In two, you can sort of actually, you can actually, surprisingly, you can actually buy them in two, although they just cost a lot, like a stupid amount of money. They do, I have, Which I is have actually agree with them on the Hey, treasure. Monsters, but treasure. Hello. Oh, no. No. Oh, well, I... Uh-uh. You found a chest, I found. Freaking kill them already, ready, uh. Yeah, I still <laughs> golems. I wonder what this holds. It must be something good if reach, at the guy. If reach, golems if reach, them. kill, quick. For the love of Destroy, all that freaking crush, holy kill. kill! Schwag. No, these things are pure death. Megan of Swag? Oh no, worse than Megan of Swag. Vargas of the Gimpfist? Worse than that. My god. That's pretty Blood fucking sword. I love that. So that's all, I think I found you a new sword. Rip that freaking blade, man. That's worse. What are you thinking, Cecil? What the hell? Aww. It's worse. Well, I'm blitz, keeping him with the ice like, brand. Oh my god. Like the ultimate weapon in two. What the blood sword is? Yeah, the blood sword is like literally the most powerful weapon, like sword in the game, like in two. Upset right there. It's quite beautiful, actually. The beautiful destruction. It is so. It really is. And the fact that it's like you don't have to heal. You don't have to heal anyone who uses that weapon because they can just pretty much steal the health out of cool. anyone. Want to know something I found out today earlier, good sir? Uh, what is that? But I thought this was so cool. But uh, okay, what? my dad got the new like Lego Batman game, and yeah, he's a little kid on the inside. But uh, oh, that seems interesting. Suddenly silence. Sorry, I just. Sorry. Something, 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 dark side. Okay. Yes, that. Uh, no, but, uh. So, the guy that, pl the guy that voice acts as the Joker, and I thought this was so Mark cool. Mark Hamill? Is, wait, what? No. Mark Hamill? No, in, in the game, not the actual Joker, Joker. Oh, so. No. Just the, guy that does it, the guy that does him in the Lego game is the same yeah. guy who did the voice as Kefka in Dissidia. Oh my god, really? Yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. That is this awesome. This man is Edge. Oh, hi, Edge. Now look, it's Mr. Ribigante hiding behind his cloak. Looking quite badass. Oh, crap. Dude, he just pwned <laughs> Edge. That was hilarious. Goodbye, Mr. Ribigante. Edge did not know what just happened to him. There was some sissy, <laughs> sissy press. Yes, you, yes, we do. Tell me the only answer. And Rose is so nice to Kieran. Edge, you are going to die. Ninja, he's a ninja. Ninjas! Only these guys are. Only these ninjas are kind of cool. Yes, this is Edge having two kunais, a green beret, a black belt, and some missile gloves, which we want want to give him the power armlet. Mm -hmm. she, um... I, I will tell you that, so you do probably want to keep him actually with this stuff he's got. Now we're back at the Tower of a Middle somehow. Whee! Okay. Mr. Ta but only as a shock, we are in a different level of the Tower of the Middle. Suddenly I'm an edge. I'm not going home. The Koi Girls, I'll wait with you, please. Oh, there's a monster egg I could have taken care of. That. Seems like we were just in here yesterday. Oh. Well, technically this is the same recording session as that. 
But I guess it could be the same as yesterday. Yeah, it's the same day, but I don't even want to know I don't what those know. were. Ah, balloons. Okay, that seems... Oh, more curls and something bad and evil. Oh, mad ogres. Ogres. They're especially evil, I believe. I can't escape. Um, you might be. Depends. How come they get to attack before I do? Uh oh. I think I pretty much just let Kane take a beating. And that does happen, sadly. Cecil just like start jumping on him. Or, well, more likely Kane. Yeah, you or Russo, you can just go back to healing. Look at him with Pig. Maybe there's like a slight possible chance I can hit him with a pig. No, I cannot. What a great, now Cecil's down. This is why I do not like mad ogres. No one really does, because they're kind of assholes, you might say. I don't say I know. I guess I paralyzed it. Good. Hey! Gives me a chance to start, like, wailing on it and get everybody else back up. Get the ogre killer. Ooh, lovely. That's, That's a nice weapon. Actually, you know what? No, Kane, we just found you a new best friend. I hit you jump a bit, but you can handle. I'm only dropping by six, so he's okay. I'd assume. All well, bad in the fact that it helps the deal with the problem with the ogres at least slightly. Slightly. Since the other killer does a little more damage to them, as its name implies. Okay, so for a while. The heck is a kiss of Lilith? Oh, same effect as Osmos. Mm. Oh, yeah, the, uh, the Osmos is a beautiful thing.
I tamed Ahura. Things is a save point somewhere. You know? That's ah, yeah. the devil. Well, generally, the, the, yeah, you found it. I think you found it. And I said it. And as with a lot of Final Fantasy, that means there's a boss nearby. That, and that's the end of the episode. My of course. God. I'm not going to do that again. I'll just see you guys in the next episode. I can't even think of anything to say. Dude. Bye. See you guys then. Bye.